Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. I am going to be showing you my second bullet journal that I have that I like to keep like different things in, like special readathons that are happening or just general stuff that won't fit in my original bullet journal, which this one is already up and live. And you can catch it. So let's go ahead and go through my second one. And I think you guys will like this one as well. And it's a super shiny and it's got gold pages at the edges of it. And it's just, oh, we like it here. All right. We're going to open up to the first page. And, of course, I've always got my fun little quotes. And I do love Servant in Dove. I can't wait for the second book. And then, of course, we got the... Dr. Seuss had the Grinch stole Christmas because I love the Grinch and had to have him. This one I got a little bit more going on. I got the A Game of the Throne chair. I don't need to say any more because we know it's from Game of Thrones. And then I got Strange the Dreamer. I got Lazlo Strange. I never know exactly how to say her name, but it's the girl who has the moths that can go into people's dreams while they're sleeping so uh, there is that i just love this one and then i have uh, the cast of six of grows which is another favorite book of mine which i will be doing a top 10 favorite books of all time and then there's a couple of blank pages before we get to the actual start of this I started this July 2019, and this was just like my little reading stuff that I had going on. I was keeping track of like my channel and like my Twitter at one point. I need to add that back in because I have a little bit more people than when I did in July, so that's amazing. And I love every single one of you. And then my books, I still need to try and finish of course and then I also did Cramathon in August and I have a quote from the cruel prince and then I did my little TBR and the challenges that they had then I tried to do Cramathon every now and again when I hear it's announced I missed the last one so we're not worried about it but it's okay and then another Cruel Prince. Do you see a theme going on here? And that cute little stack of books. Again, a Halloween reading that I did myself because I like to start my Halloween reading in September and October for two months. So if I don't finish it in September, it is okay to try to finish it in October if I can. And then I have Strange the Dreamer quote, which is, again another favorite book of mine and then I wrote down my favorite books of 2019 I may or may not do a video for that but that's not the top 10 video of favorite books that I'm gonna post just so you're aware and then of course another cruel prince quote at this point are you guys surprised because I'm not I <laughs> kind of forgot to fill these parts out. I had them set up for like Vlogmas and then like the December thing. So we'll probably try to do this next year. So there's that. And then again, 25 days of Vlogmas. A cute little present box that I drew and a little December printed thing I printed out and then of course we have the Hunger Games quote because that's another favorite book and again watch out for that video soon and then I started half of it but I didn't get them all down just yet I have a quotes page of all my favorite quotes that I like I have up to seven so far I'm not gonna read them all but I'll try to show them here but yes I have an extra page for when I want to write more. And then again, I I don't know why I have two different pages, the favorite books of 2019, but I do. And another 
Hunger Games quote, fire is catching it, and if we burn, then you will burn with us. Ahem. <clears throat> Not sorry. <laughs> and then another cute little stack of books for goals I want to do for 2020. I just love how this one turned out, too. And then, of course, my Hocus Pocus readathon that we do in October. I love this little heading, so I had to stick it in here. Red Rising, because I'm obsessed. And books I want to read it in 2020. Holy moly, can we get there? Stay tuned. We will see. And then, of course, I wrote down, which I already did a video for, for books I want to read in 2020. I got up to 21 books down instead of 20 uh, just because I couldn't just stick with 20. I had to go that extra mile, you know? Alright, and then here I have a quote from... Oh, I've seen what you truly are. Oh, the first is Shadow and Bone. I didn't know if it was the first book or the second book because I haven't read the second one yet. But I definitely have this quote in there. And I have a cute Halloween thing. And this was the spread I did last year for my Hocus Pocus. I had a Sabrina because it was halloween -y And uh, the broomstick. And just some little art stuff. I'm not the best at drawing. But I do try. And then this is, was like the teams that we had. We had Team Sanderson Sisters, Team Undead. And then we had a Team Trick or Treaters, which we'll have again this year. And then the actual original TBR that I tried to follow. And then there's another part of the Team Sanderson Sisters, Undead, the cute little bats. And then the team that I was on, which is team, which was team trick or treaters, and then all oh, thanks. And that's it on that page. I didn't do anything else with it. I just stuck the cat on there because I thought it was cute. And then the books that I read in September, I started off doing this so I would remember what I read and so I could review, which I've already had that video up. Now this page I worked on the other nights. Which is all the books I want to read or try to get to for this month. I thought this spread turned out super cute. And I got all the names of the books down. And I will try to color in the little boxes once I got them. Once I get them done and I'll put like the stars if I have room next to it. So I really like this spread a lot. And then of course, favorite set of 2020 for when I get to them and then this is just how well do I know my book challenge that video I may do eventually and then I wrote it on the other side and then I did a theme for January with a little cute hot cocoa mug with candy cane and servants and dove quotes because I just, I'm obsessed with servant and dove I don't know how many times I can say that in this video <laughs> I am not sorry. Alright, and then this is my current TBR for January. And then a couple of favorite books or one that I need to get into that i liking so far. One I've actually read and thought it was really cute middle grade book. And then I just like wrote little things down below in case if someone comes across these notebooks and wants to keep them. Which I hope because I put a lot of heart into them. And the Wicked King and Vicious. You know I had to have them back to back, right? Sorry, I couldn't quite hear you. Good. Could you please repeat what you said? No, because I didn't say Zuri. I hate that. And then Ruin of the Kings, which is another book I like. That I need to finish the rest of. <laughs> and then here's my new spread for Hocus Pocus Readathon. And this time I actually drew my own little kitty. So we'll just pretend that he's Binks slash Mr. Kindly because, uh, yes. 
and then I got room there for whatever book group we decide to pick and I can write it down and that's about all I got for that spread and then the once we figure out the prompts I will add them in later of course so again team Sanderson sisters team undead team trick-or-treaters I might change up my mind on which team I want to be on this year but I think I have an idea of what team I want and then of course the TBR for when that comes so I got that page ready and then of course right here another red rising thing because again I'm obsessed and I like and we want and we put it in there and that's for like September slash Halloween reading for 2020 which I have an idea of what I want to read in September already so I kind of put it down here and I got 21 books I don't know if I will get to all of them but I got it down and I need to look up for a book title so that's why 8 is blank because I didn't quite look it up just yet and I plan to and then that is the last page that I have so far in this and in this one when I bought it, it came with these cute little stickers that I've been using every now and again, so I will deck it out with those. And then I also have another Red Rising little quote in here. And again, another Red Rising because like I said, we're obsessed. And then Servant and Dove quotes because we're not really surprised at this moment in time. Alright, and there you guys have it. That is my second bullet journal. Like I said, I like to put my heart and soul into each one, and they're a little different, and that is definitely okay. So if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscription down there, or down there, wherever it may be. And the notification bell so you don't miss further videos from me and i will see you guys in my next one and hoping you're having a good day or night and of always get some unexpected reading in of course and i'll see you guys in my next one bye